I once ruined a blind date by playing with my shellfish. <laughs> OK, um... It's been described as many things. <laughs> Paint the picture. Where are we? Uh, we are at a restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's not giving too much away. No, too no but it's dinner. It's, it's, it's dinner for two people who haven't met before. How did you arrange the blind date? Um, it was a competition, of course. A competition? Yeah, it was, it was a competition uh, where uh, you could win <laughs> a shellfishy, seafoody dinner with Joel from Neighbours. Uh, oh. You were the prize. It wasn't a great competition, <laughs> let's be honest. But yeah, it was. It was. You could, you could win a date. Did you uh, like vet the applicants, <laughs> or was it, or was it genuinely blind? Yeah, because it does feel like if they knew that it was you, mm. in order for it to be genuinely blind, you would have had to gouge their eyes out. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I guess it was 50% blind. Oh, wasn't you, it? Blind Cause... for you. Yeah, blind, blind for, for you. All oh, right. That's referred to as a uh, partially sighted date. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Can I ask, how do you play with the shellfish? Well, what does that I actually don't know look like? If you've ever been on a blind date that is going horrifically bad and you want to lighten the mood. So <laughs> you've got uh, a, a, a longestine, perhaps. And so I picked up the shellfish. And I kind of went, wee! Oh, gosh. Um, right, so rather than tell amusing <laughs> stories about life on the set of Neighbours, you thought, I know how I'll break the ice here. I'll pick up the meal <laughs> and wave it in front of their face. <laughs> and say, wee! Wee! <laughs> wee! And, and, and that went well. <laughs> so it turns out that the blind date was vegan. <laughs> and she, she, she stood up and ran to the bathroom in tears. And I uh, was there with my shellfish alone uh, until she returned. And, and of course, because it's for a magazine, there was a photographer there as well, watching the whole oh, thing, capturing the whole thing. Date comes back, says, you know what? I don't want to be here. And you know what? Screw it. I've got a boyfriend anyway. And disappears. It seems like a slight overreaction, especially on a sort of artificial date. It where was you, a big shellfish. You know, oh. I can understand that, but to actually walk out when it's clear there's media there, it's, you know, she, she knows that'll be drawing attention to herself. I didn't Why pick wouldn't him. she just laugh and say privately, hey, don't do that again? I'm not crazy about the shellfish. Why would you leave the restaurant entirely? And that's what has been bugging me for 20 years. Morton Bay bugs. <laughs> yeah. Morton Bay bugging you. Yeah. Exactly. So I don't know. I don't know the answer to that, but. Um, there was no second date. She didn't have a lisp by any chance? She <laughs> have a lisp? No. Yeah. No, OK, that's right. Because I thought there might have just been a misunderstanding where she was just saying that you were very selfish. <laughs> Fair that's question. No, that's that's all. All. Don't clap we get that, that out of the way? <laughs> good. No. That's okay. good. No. Well, I think our question time for Dan is over. What do you think? Is that a truth or a lie? Look, it, it seems far-fetched. I'm leaning towards that it might be true. The fact he was in England, where they do tend to eat langoustine more than mm. prawn, that, that is a good detail for me to suggest it might be true. What do you reckon? Well, I, I wasn't focusing on the specifics of the crustacean. <laughs> <laughs> what were you focusing on, Lloyd? How you could get a date through a competition. <laughs> it's quite a pathetic way to meet women, isn't it? Like, uh, I'm thinking it might be true. What do you think, Jalen? If I was cross-examining you, I'd be saying, liar! Um, you're saying lie, I'm saying true. I think it's true. We're going to say true. Dan McPherson, is that story true or that a lie? That story is... true. <laughs> Yeah, it was excruciating. It is true. Dan really did ruin a blind date by playing with his shellfish. <laughs> Although his date was impressed by the size of his muscles. Hey. <laughs>